Oh, didn't see you guys there. My name is Bert from QVS, and I just want to show you the uh, installation for the VW-4PH. Um, as you can see on the screen, I have uh, pretty much a running off of a Windows system. Uh, the VW-4PH acts just like a wireless router, so on the bottom right-hand corner, you can go ahead and click on it so you can see all your wireless connections. And by default, it's called WPS, so let's go ahead and click on that and go to connect. If you give it a second or so, it should go ahead and connect. Let's see. Okay, and right now it's showing limited connection, but it is uh, connected to the WPS system. Okay, from there, we could open up your favorite web browser. Uh, I like using Google Chrome, so I could go ahead and open that. And I'm going to have to type in the IP address. By default, it should be 192.168.100.10. Go ahead and hit enter, and it brings you to the wireless presentation system page. From there, go ahead and click on download which will download the software onto your system. As you can see, we have uh, Windows. We also have, uh, for their PDAs, Windows Mobile 5, and also for Mac. Since I'm running on Windows, I'm going to go ahead and click on the download on the top one. And on the bottom left-hand corner, should go ahead and start downloading. OK. And from there, let's go ahead and open the program. Go ahead and run the program. And here's the uh, security, so let's go ahead and click on yes. And now here's the uh, the wizard for the setup. It's a pretty simple setup. All you have to do is click right on next, and it's all done. And it does open the program right away. So as soon as it's done connecting, it'll show you the uh, WPS uh, SSID, which is the uh, the wireless that it's showing. Go ahead and click on connect and give it a few seconds it'll search for the device and then ask for the login code the login code should be right on the screen and by default it does change every time the uh, device restarts just for security so let's go ahead and type in the login code which is 8538 and click on OK and this uh, changes your uh, resolution to uh, 1024 by 768 for best image projection quality. But let's go ahead and, uh, if you'd like to change it to that, go ahead and click OK. If not, you can go ahead and click Cancel and it keeps your screen resolution. And now, as you can see, everything that I'm doing right now should be on the screen. So let me go ahead and minimize this, show the background, and you have the uh, WPS system installed. For more information, check us out at QVS.com or visit one of the many retailers that carry QVS products.